what is a file no not this one so we are talking about computer files we have many different files like image pdf video and text file and there are thousand different types of file but what mm. exactly is a file and if i rename the extension of the file will it convert from one file type to another file type and that's what we are finding out in this video let's start by understanding what is exactly a file so whether it be image video or any text file everything is stored inside a storage it could be your hard drive ssd or anything so basically in a storage if you create a file it is a sequence of bytes just it is a sequence of byte whether it be any kind of file so bytes combine to form kilobyte megabyte and gigabyte that we see on our file sizes so bytes are nothing but sequence of zeros and one a set of eight zero and one is called a byte so byte one two three four four byte is a set of eight four the 32 32 bits so according to that uh, a file is a sequence of bytes so the next question is if every kind of file is a sequence of byte then how are files different how is image different from video and video is different from text file now the bytes stored in file is interpreted as image video or text which is determined by the program reading it so if it is a program that reads text file for example a text editor like notepad if it reads the file it interpret every bytes as a text file if the program is image viewer then the image viewer will read this file bytes and try to interpret it as a image data so now everything comes down to encoding for example we encode bytes into letters and characters in uh, ascii encoding so here we say that let's say uh 79 yep 79 is interpreted as letter o capital o this 79 is nothing but a decim decimal which is a conversion from byte to you know a decimal character for ease of use and understanding so basically it is also a byte but represented as a decimal number so as you can see we represent numbers into letters in coding we say 120 is equals to a character small x here 87 is w so this is encoding we encoded the bytes into letters and characters using ascii encoding so similarly images also have encoding types we have jpeg png different types of files which have their own encoding styles now we understand the interpretation part but how the program will understand what type of file is it if it is a image file video file or text file how will it know so it knows the type of the file with a magic number a magic number is the starting bytes of a file which determines the type of file so for example i have a small program and set of files here the main program here is a simple program that reads bytes of a file and returns it and prints it on the terminal so let's say for example i am reading a 1.2.pdf file it is the name of the file and i am trying to read the first 20 bytes if i read first 20 bytes you will see the sequence of bytes here but if i change the file and let's say i read the file 1.2 both of the files are different both are not the same file i have not just renamed those files both are a different file but now if you notice the first few bits one two three four five six seven eight nine first nine bytes are same in both of them you notice that after that these bytes are completely different depending on the contents inside the file same goes with different files let's say i read 2.1.png now i will read 20 bytes from png file and again i will read different png file once again if you see the first these many bytes are same this is the magic number so this combination of bytes represents a png file whereas if you see in the pdf file this combination of 
first bytes represent a pdf file these numbers are called magic numbers the magic number of different files are very standard which you can find on wikipedia list of file signature if you see every kind of file has a signature and the initial bytes represent that file for example if i search png so here i can see the png file has a signature of these for the initial bytes of a file this is it is different because it is in hexadecimal format but in our case it is in raw bytes so if you convert these bytes into hexadecimal then you will see the same hexadecimal which is present here so according to the magic number present at the beginning bytes of file the program determines what type of file is it and according to that it will interpret it now to conclude this part till now we have understood that a file is nothing but a sequence of byte and the data makes sense depending on the type of encoding that it is done by the reader program so if the reader program reads the sequence of byte as an image it will form an image if it reads at text it will be text so now let's move on to the next part if i change the extension name of file will it change the type of the file now i have renamed the box here and named it image.png so if i change a file name for example any file here if i change the name from let's say image.png to image. Um, let's say a PDF will it change the file from a PNG image file to a PDF file no of course it will not because the PNG encoding and PDF encoding are different at the end both are bytes but the way they are encoded the way the sequence are present in the file is different so changing the png file to a pdf file will not change the bytes and of course not to mention the magic number which is present at the beginning will also not change so simply renaming the extension doesn't change the file type so what is the extension is there for so extension is used by our operating system and programs to identify what type of file is it so on a surface level but inside when the program starts to read the type of file is determined by the sequence of bytes and also based on the extension name the operating system or file manager tries to open the file according to the type of the file handler for example if it is an image let's say the image is .png .jpg or anything related to image it will try to open the file using a image viewer if it is a pdf file it will try to open it with a pdf viewer so that is determined by the file extension now what if i try to open a image file with a text editor and an image viewer the behavior of image viewer will be typical we know the image viewer will show the image but the text editor will try to read the image file as if it is a text file and try to apply the ascii encoding so it try to read the byte and for every byte it will try to map the byte into a character but of course it will fail because the encoding is different from image and text so for example if i show you so for example you can see here i have opened the same file social dot social avatar dot jpg in two different programs one is a text editor and another is a file image file viewer but you can see the text editor did not complain it start reading the bytes and try to interpret it as a text file but it output some gibberish and some meaningful bytes you know the opening brackets small brackets some characters but not everything so it doesn't restrict you but it will make sense for the image viewer to see the image but it will not make sense for the text editor because it is not a text file now let's conclude everything now we know that a file is a sequence of byte and the encoding depends on the type of the file if it is image it is maybe encoded in jpg or it is a text file it will be encoded in ascii and the file type is determined by the magic number which is present at the beginning of the file and different programs interpret it in different way image viewer will, will interpret it as an image and text editor will interpret it as a text file so at the end the program will make sense of the file and display it according to what encoding it tries to understand using the bytes so yeah that's that's the story of file here see you in the next one keep watching